What's up, welcome back to the Airsoft Guys YouTube channel and today we're going to be looking at the best loadout gear you can get for under £100. Okay, so if you've been watching the channel before, you might know that we're new to Airsoft. Um, we just started this YouTube channel, our Instagram, Twitter, Facebook and whatnot. Um, so we're trying to build that up and what we really want to do is help new players get into the game. A lot like we did and we've spent ages looking at information on the internet trying to find the best, you know, best stuff we can get um, for, for not too much money. So first thing, the Bolly Tracker 2 goggles. You get the carry case like this and it's like the carry case you have your goggles. And these are quite nice, as, as mentioned in the other video, they are you know, almost full seal and they have a foam lip around them. Haven't had any issues with them fogging, they've played about four matches so far. Uh, they're really, really nice and comfortable to wear. Quite low profile and you know, they, they look alright as well. The next item on the list is face protection. Now, some people choose not to roll with face protection, uh, but I've actually been at a match where someone has had a two shot out. Um, so I always run with a half face mask. Uh, but this is nice and comfortable, um, it looks good, it goes well with our setup. It's kind of got a, a camo design on the front of the grill. Um, but it's full metal, um, it's moldable, so you can bend this and basically this strap will go around the back of your head and put it on completely. It covers up all of your face here and then obviously you'll go with protecting that. Okay, so item three, we have the tactical gloves. Now these are just very basic gloves uh, from eBay. Um, they come with slight knuckle protectors here. We've also got small air vents just here. Uh, they're thin enough for you to change your mag um, to operate your gun properly. Um, probably not thin enough to change your hop up or something like that. Uh, but everything I need to do, I can get done with these gloves. Okay, so item four, we have the tactical vest. Now it's just an unbranded tactical vest. It came in at about twenty pounds, but um, it does everything that you need as a beginner player. If you're just doing skirmishes, this is going to suit you fine. So you get three mag pouches here. Um, these are M4 style mag pouches. They fit the magazines really nicely. Easy to pull out as well. Up here, you get a small document pouch. Um, you can run a patch here, uh, this is just velcro behind it, and a small pistol mag pouch. And you get a utility pouch on the side, um, which I personally store my phone and a small bottle of water in. It's a molly system um, on the back and on the front, so you can design this how you want it to be. Um, it's a fairly flexible setup. Uses Velcro on the sides with clips in, and it's also got a quick release system. So, the main items we have here is your camouflage gear. So, we have multi cam trousers, um, there's plenty of pocket space. We've got two large cargo pockets here, um, normal pockets with a zipped pocket inside. So, in this kit as well, you also get a UVAX. Um, so you have velcro patches on the side. Now when ordering it does say to order a size up because these come up quite tight. Uh, I'm normally a medium um, so I order the large and this comes up a little bit too big. Uh, I would prefer this to be a tighter fit. Um, obviously if you want to prefer a loose fit then definitely go the size up but I would say stick to where the size you are. Now this looks nice. Olive green and then multi cam on the side. Very comfortable to wear. Um, obviously this material here will wick sweat away from your body and keep you comfortable while you're playing, especially if you're going to be in this all day. And finally we have the camo shirt. So this is an overshirt, you can wear it over the u back or on, over a t-shirt, depending on how hot it is. Um, again, you've got the patch panels on the side. Now what you can do is you can just swap those panels that you get from the u backs onto here. Now this is very, very nice. Um, just felt grows up like this and again about the sizing thing go for your normal size on this as well. That's all we've got for the under £100. Um, there's obviously a few things you might want to add, maybe a cap, um, maybe a tactical belt. Now these things aren't necessary but this is like all of the gear that you would need to get into airsoft and start playing. Um, this is what we've been running for the last few matches and um, we have no complaints so far. Um, 
under £100, you can't really go wrong either. Now, a lot of people will say, yeah, if you're just skirmishing, you don't need camo gear, but hey, it looks it looks better, it looks more professional. Um, it's also ripstop gear, so we know that it's durable and it's you know it's not going to fail on us instead of ripping up our own clothes. Now, this is going on the assumption that you have some boots of your own. Um, obviously, boots are going to be necessary for any airsoft games that you play, uh, especially with high ankle support boots. So, thanks a lot for watching. This has been the Airsoft Guys. Make sure you check us out on Instagram, the Airsoft Guys, Twitter, Airsoft Guys UK, and Facebook slash Airsoft Guys. Remember to subscribe for more videos. Um, if you like it, hit that like button. And if you want to share what you think of this kit, then just comment below. If you found some better options, great. Um, stick them in the comments, we'll check them out, let you know what we think. Um, if it's good, then we'll buy it and we'll do a review on it. So, thanks a lot for watching. Take care. Over and out.